the banana that you see before you is not as innocent as it might seem. In fact, this banana has sparked outrage and protests across American University. In fact, even the FBI was called in to help investigate these nefarious bananas. In fact, I'm starting to believe that bananas are the new symbol of white supremacy. But in all seriousness, this banana with the words Harambe bait written on it hanging from a tree was reported as a hate crime at American University in Washington, D.C. I think it's more likely that these bananas were a reference to the shooting of Harambe. I believe he died May 28th of last year, so it would mark just about a year since his passing. However, these students didn't feel that way. These students felt that they were being attacked and targeted, and they had a list of demands that needed to be met. The list of demands states the following. For the remainder of the semester, the bridge will become a sanctuary for people of color. All POC students get extensions and should not be penalized for already scheduled finals after the incident. And finally, a separate investigation team based out of the university, composed of a group of non-biased expert contractors that can investigate cases of racism and discrimination brought against the institution of American University. They have also announced that this is only the beginning of their list of upcoming demands. They say that they have plans to change the deal, so to speak. It reminds me of a certain Sith Lord. But anyway, the gist of what happened is that the parking structure was completely blocked off by organized students who were angry that there was an appointment that was canceled and rescheduled, and they thought that they were being ignored and refused to be ignored any longer while, you know, black people are hunted down in the streets, persons of color are not safe. I don't know where they are getting this idea from, probably their professors, actually. So to summarize, this banana caused a huge disturbance across the campus over at American University. Enough of a disturbance that the FBI actually had to get called, and there were protests, and a list of demands, and yet again we have grown-ass cry bullies, and investigating a banana hanging from a tree as being a hate crime is ridiculous. Almost as ridiculous as investigating a banana hanging from a tree, let alone calling in the FBI. They say that heroes never die and that legends live forever. And that's why I am dedicating this video to Harambe. Harambe was only 17 years old when he passed away. God needed a meme, and so he took Harambe. He was not the hero we deserved. He was the hero we needed. Although it has been quite fantastic this last year, it would have been even more fantastic with Harambe at our side. We miss you, brother.